today's gacha story, I'm reacting to this one called If the Afton Family Hired a Babysitter by Masufa as well as the Afton Kids Out of Daycare by Kelly Plays. I'll have both original videos in the description down below and let me know what other gacha stories you'd like to see react to next. Okay, I'll repeat. We're not going to send our children to the adoption center. But. No buts. Well, then what should we do with them? Seriously, one day they'll enslave us and save the world domination. Have you read too many books? They're just kids. What if these just kids burn down or flood the house or get into some big trouble while we're at home? We can't keep an eye on them all the time because of work. Hmm. What if we hire a babysitter? Oh, 2,000 years later? Huh? What do you mean by we hired a babysitter? You heard me, right? She starts working today, so try to make sure that she doesn't run away from us after working for the first day. Why do we even need a babysitter? I'm not six anymore, and I can take care of Chris, Liz, and myself. You're totally irresponsible. Hey, I'm not. I said it all. The conversation is over. Uh, hmm. uh, do you hear that? Yes. I don't want a babysitter! Me too! What if she's evil? I never thought I'd say this, but we need to work together if we want to get rid of her. But she's coming today! Do you think we'll have time to come up with a plan? You don't have to worry about that. You have me. They're really good kids. There'll be no problems at all. I hope. <laughs> Does everyone remember the plan? Yeah! Don't worry, you will become good friends. You can go and be sure that your children will be fine. I have good work experience. You can go meet the kids. We're late, so let's go, Will. Uh, let's meet the kids. <gasps> Such cuties! Let's get acquainted. My name is Lilith. And what about you? Mike, Chris, Elizabeth. Nice to meet you three. What do you want to do? Do you want to draw? Of course. But first, I'm going to close the door. We act as agreed. <laughs> I finished. Can I see? Here you go. Uh, um, is that me? <laughs> And who is this one? It's my friend! We always play together! <laughs> she just has a rich imagination! Blah, 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 blah! <laughs> who are you talking to? With my friend! This friend again! Can you describe your friend? Well, he's black and tall, has long arms and red eyes! <sighs> He's right behind you! Uh, uh, what? Nothing! Do these kids see something? I'm gonna cook something, okay? Mm -hmm. It was kinda creepy! <laughs> huh? Something happened? Oh, it's nothing! Do, 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 do. Did they tell you about Boo? Boo? Their friend. Oh, yeah! Your siblings have a good imagination! He's not just imagination. When I was little, I saw him too. He's been living at our house for many years. He really hates adults. You know, you're not the first babysitter here. The very first accidentally fell down the stairs. It's pretty interesting, isn't it? Oh, I, I brought you some cakes. Oh. Huh? There's only three cakes here. Yeah? What about Boo? He likes cakes too. He'll be really mad. Don't you remember what I said earlier? You better listen to them. Oh boy. These kids are really creepy. Maybe a good book will help to distract. Uh -huh. uh, what in the world was that? Uh, 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 yeah. Oh my, it's five o'clock. There's only one hour left and their parents will be back. <laughs> so quiet. You're right. Maybe everyone is asleep. Oh, Mr. and Mrs. Afton, you're finally back. Are you okay, dear? Yes, I'm pretty fine. I think I'll go home. To an adoption center? Mission fast. <laughs> I don't know why they didn't like that babysitter. She was really nice. You three are grounded! Oh! Hello, everyone. It's your awesome William Afton here. And I've been wondering why my kids have been acting weird. Just look at this! Dad, can we go somewhere? No, 
Oh, no, it's not that weird, but next day, Cece was with Elizabeth to ask me to go somewhere. Please? Uh, uh, it's not normal for him to ask me that. It would be Elizabeth that asked me that kind of stuff. But, you know what surprised me even more? This! My dad. Get up and take us somewhere fun. Oh, I'm surprised because he usually likes to stay at home than going out. A day after, I found out why they were acting weird. We have to get him to say yes this time. When are you going to give up? Never! I will never let up until he says yes. That's why Cece and Michael have been acting weird lately. <laughs> you won't believe what I did. Well, I did this. Let's go somewhere fun, please. Please, please, why am I here again? Hmm, please say yes. Fine. <gasps> he accepted? For real? Yay! 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 I can't believe that he accepted. Let's go! Uh, I sent them to a daycare. But my wife doesn't seem to like it though. If I accepted it, Elizabeth would waste my money. William, you're a billionaire. A billionaire! B -b but they're going to be at a daycare for a while. They wanted a fun place, so I chose the daycare. Daycare is a fun place, you know? Am I wrong? Whatever. Of course daycare is a fun place. That's why I chose that. Big brain moment. Anyway, I wonder what the kids are doing right now. Meanwhile, he tricked us. He tricked us! He sure got us. Why the heck am I at a daycare? Hello there. You must be Elizabeth, Cece, and Michael. Am I right? Yeah, that's us. I see. Your father told me to take care of you for a while. And I heard that Michael is accompanying Elizabeth and Cece to take care of them as well. That old man! That's correct, right, Michael? Uh, uh, say no, Mike! Yeah, that's true. But... That's so nice of you, Michael. So since you're here to accompany your siblings, why don't you help me with the daycare too? Are you willing to help me with the daycare? Tell the truth, Mike! Uh, 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 sure, I guess. Thank you so much, Michael. Why is it so hard to say no? Why can't you tell the truth, Mike? <laughs> Then can you take care of the kids for me? Sure. All right. Thank you, Michael. I'll go now. If you need something from me, you can find me there. All right. Thank you. Why the heck did I accept that? I can't handle kids. Why didn't you tell her the truth, Mike? I don't know. My mouth seems to refuse for me to say no. Yeah, yeah. And aren't you the one that wants to go somewhere fun? Yeah? What's wrong with it? For your information, daycare is a fun place. So that's probably the reason why we're here. Mike is not wrong though. Whatever. Just go do your job. AKA taking care of the kids. Your favorite activity. Whatever. I'm going. What now? I don't know. This is boring. I bet Dad is happy without us bothering him. Meanwhile... I'm glad that nobody's bothering our date. I can't understand you sometimes, William. What do you mean? You can afford this place. But you can't afford a small thing. It's our special day, so I can afford this. That makes no sense. Back with Elizabeth and Cece again? Are we just gonna stare at each other? I don't know. I just wanna go home. It's very boring here. Why don't you go play with the kids over there? I'm not interested. I just thought of something. Why don't we walk to her house? So we don't have to wait for dad to pick us up. I don't think it's a good idea. I mean, we'll get lost eventually. T true. I mean, I don't even know our house address. I don't know either. Yeah. Well, I'll definitely get lost. <laughs> but there's someone here that knows our house address. And that is... Michael! Michael! Our house address? Yeah. Do you have any idea where our house is? Nope. Uh, how come? You're supposed to remember because you stayed at the house for years. Liz, do you remember that we got a new house a month ago? Is that? I haven't memorized it. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. What? Where are you going, Cece? I'm going to greet someone over there. Uh-huh, that's weird. Does he know someone here besides us? <laughs> Is that you, Cindy? Cece? Hey, Cindy. What a coincidence. Yeah. Oh, it's Cindy. 
<gasps> the Afton family visits Clara's family. Explain Cindy. So what are you doing here? Well, I wanted to go to a daycare. And mom allowed me to go here. I, I see. The reason I'm here is literally the opposite. Except for the last part, though. What about you, Cece? Why are you here? Me? Uh, I guess it's because of Elizabeth. She wanted to go somewhere fun, but we ended up at a daycare. Oh, but at least I get to meet you here. Me too. <laughs> Why me? Big Brother Mike. Hey, Lilith. Big Brother. Huh? Who is this ugly chicken? Excuse me? First of all, I'm not an ugly chicken. Second of all, he's my brother, not yours. Is that true? Uh, yeah. See? And I'm going to be Michael's wife. Oh, heck no! As his sister, I don't accept a little brat to be my brother's wife. I don't care, you ugly chicken. Hmm. Thank you so much for taking care of my marriage. We're now officially wife and husband. Thank you. Oh, let's go play family, my husband. Whoa, whoa. Hey, don't forget about me, you brat. Sure. You can be the chicken. No way. Oh. Wow, what a great friendship they have. I know, right? <laughs> We're, We're not, not friends. friends. Oh, that's weird. Where's your plushie, Cece? Uh, 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 um, uh, oh, uh, sorry, Cindy. I forgot to bring them. Oh, it's fine. Although, I want to see Goldie the plushie in the dress again. Uh, uh, maybe next time when we meet again. <laughs> My beautiful husband. Uh, back away. Hey, where are you going? <laughs> That was my worst nightmare ever. And then Michael never went near Lilith anymore. A few hours later. Hello, my awesome children. It's time for you to say bye to the daycare. <clears throat> what? Uh, wait, wait. Uh, hey, don't ignore me like that. Uh, all right. Michael, wait. Yes? For you. Thank you for helping me. Uh, what's inside this, ma'am? Some desserts. Uh, oh, uh, th thank you for the desserts, ma'am. You're welcome. Have a nice day. You too. Uh... Bye! Can I have the desserts? I mean, you can't eat. Fine. I can't eat anyway. Don't worry, Mike. You can hug the desserts. Uh, I guess that's true. <laughs> Press F for Michael. <laughs> so that was If the Afton Family Hired a Babysitter by Husufa, as well as The Afton Kids at a Daycare by Callie Place. I'll have both original videos in the description down below. Let me know what other gotcha stories you'd like to react to next, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a like, and if you're new, subscribe to Come Mermaid or Merman. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys.